What's up, Sagittarius? It's your girl, the Flight Empress, and I'm back to give you guys another energy update. Y'all, this reading won't resonate with all of you guys, so please, please take what resonates with you and leave the rest behind. Now, y'all gonna have to bear with me, okay, with this reading, because over the weekend, I came down with a cold or something. I, I've been sneezing, coughing, mucus. <sighs> Um, I already know we having an early fall because we already starting to have leaves fall where I live. Um, it definitely could be my allergies, but I really feel like I'm going through a lot of spiritual ascensions. Okay. Because even the light, <laughs> too much light is just too much. I'm really sensitive to energy right now. Um, but yeah, some of you guys, you could be coming down with a cold or I'm not wishing this on y'all now, but some of you guys could have a little cold or something like that. But I really feel like you're going through spiritual ascensions. Okay. Uh, also, bear with me with my words because we still in Mercury retrograde, y'all. This <laughs> shit been fucking with me. Also, what else? What else? Oh, yeah. Y'all, I will no longer be doing the Zodiac readings for an hour long anymore. All right, I'm going to try to keep this at 30 minutes, but if I still don't see the views or the likes and stuff like that go up, I might try to drop it down to like 15 minutes. Um, it's about an equal give and take, okay? So if y'all don't mind, please like this video and don't forget to share it if you can. If you know somebody out there that do watch this type of stuff, please share it. Thank you. Um. Also, I had a young lady to reach out to me and she said, when are you going to do the Sagittarius reading? And I told her as soon as I got a chance. Um, family, I was going to do y'all reading the other night, but the energy was too heavy and spirit told me no. As soon as I thought of Sagittarius, I heard no. Um, I don't know. Some of you guys could be going through a lot right now, but I feel like your energy could be a little bit intense around this time. Or there could be some tension coming up. <sighs> I definitely picked up on like extreme, okay? There could be some extreme energy around you guys right now. But we're going to get a quick message, Saggy, <laughs> and see what spirit is wanting for you guys to know, okay? What's the energy around y'all? Divine Holy Spirit, show me what I need to see for Sagittarius. So some of you guys could be between the age of 40 and 45, or this is somebody that you know this between the ages of 40 and 45. Um, some of you guys, this could be a twin flame that's moving towards you. Okay. <clears throat> twin flame energy is moving to a new vessel, broken contract. So for some of you guys, I do feel like you could have already met your twin flame. Um, others of you, you could have met a false flame or a karmic flame. But I'm getting like there's a true twin flame that's coming towards you. And the person that's coming towards you, they might not be in this energy right now. Or I'm going to say the recent past. They might not have been in this energy, but I feel like they're going into that direction. This is somebody who's headed to their north node. Okay, uh, I'm definitely picking up on um, North Node energy. This person could be a little bit older than you, or for some of you guys, they could be a little bit younger than you. But this is somebody who's definitely doing a lot of research right now. I feel like this person is trying to find themselves. They're trying to find their place in life, what they want to be, what they want to do, the type of person they want to build with, grow with. This is somebody who is is seeking guidance right now or this is somebody who's trying to learn more about life i feel like this is somebody who done got a hold to like some new information so this person could be studying like their birth chart or somebody could have told this person stuff about chakras or told them to do some type of meditation um whoever this is I feel like they may have been going through a lot, but whatever they're doing right now is working. This is somebody who really didn't know who they was. 
I'm hearing they feel out of place or they feel like they didn't belong. This could have been somebody who was hitting like dead ends or like they would get in relationships and but they would end really quickly. Um, this is somebody who's wanting something deep. Okay, this could have been somebody who dealt with a lot of superficial people. This person could have been attracted to a lot of superficial people, but it's like once they got with them, they saw the type of life they lived or they saw that this person was like everybody else. It's giving me like, um, like once they got with them, they wasn't all what they cracked up to be. Okay, they could have got with people who, like I said, they look good on the outside but their life is a complete mess or is very chaotic or toxic. And, and this is somebody who don't want that. This is somebody who want a fairy tale story. <laughs> oh no, I'm hearing something about this person is looking for their person, okay? Like they plus one. And I feel like the people that they deal with in the past does not measure up to what they're looking for. Oh, it's funny that this person was mostly looking at superficial people, but they want something on a spiritual level. And that's just kind of odd to me. But I guess you got to have attraction in order to get to the next level, okay? But I'm seeing somebody who wants something very in-depth. They want to be able to, um, I'm here and explore. So family, for some of you guys, whoever this is, is coming towards you. They could be exploring right now. They could be like weighing their options or they're trying to get to know people. They're trying to like truly get to know people. And this could be somebody who truly want to get to know you. Spirit. Oh, we got ops. And we got baby mama. <laughs> um so there could be somebody who is wanting to come to you or will be coming to you okay whoever this is i feel like they're not with this baby mama somebody a baby mama they're not with this baby mama or their baby father this is somebody who is separated at this time but i feel like maybe this baby mama still got a lot of feelings for this person or they want this person to come back into their life and this is somebody who will set this person up, okay, just so that they don't see them with anyone else. I'm hearing sabotage. Okay, this person can have somebody connected to them that could possibly try to come in and sabotage this connection with the two of you. They don't want to see this new person with you. Some of you guys, you definitely got an enemy here. This person is between the age of 40 and 45. Um, somebody could be wanting to come in and expose something or tell you something or start some problems. We got Vixen and Fox. So this could be a female enemy for some of you guys. I feel like there's a need for you guys to really watch your back and watch who you're around, watch who you talk to. There could be somebody that you guys trust to keep a secret or something, but this person is the ops. This is somebody who is definitely going to spread rumors or this is somebody who can't hold water. I feel like this person could work with you. With Vixen and Fox being here, I'm kind of seeing somebody in like a business suit or something like that. This could be somebody that you want to go in business with or you did go in business with, but you definitely got to op around, okay? I'm seeing a feminine energy for a lot of you guys. 
for my fellas out there, this could be a baby mama. I don't know. Spirit, what else? Sagittarius. Yeah, we got fair, but it came out in a reverse. So, yeah, there's a baby mama out here that feels like something is not fair. They feel like you shouldn't be with this person or you should come back home or, you know, this is somebody who wants you to invest in them. But I feel like this is somebody you no longer care about or you no longer love or whoever is coming towards you. They no longer love or care about this person. Okay, I'm hearing something about an affair. Somebody could have got pregnant when they was having an affair. Or something here was like a one night stand. Or this could have been just casual sex or something. But there is a person here that done let this went to their head. They feel like it's more than, than what you say it is. Okay, or this is the person that's coming in to be with you. They feel like it's um more than that. Mm, spirit. So there's a need for you guys to pay attention to your surroundings as well. Pay attention to music, signs, synchronicity. Um, I feel like for some of you guys, I feel like there's communication that's coming in towards you from somebody in your community. Now, this could be somebody who's really close to you. For some of you guys, this could be somebody in your neighborhood. Um, I'm actually seeing like somebody driving by your house and it could be a little bit suspicious because this person I drove by your house a couple of times. If this is not you, this is somebody that you're dealing with or somebody that's coming in to talk to you or to be with you. Somebody have a stalker, okay, that's lurking or driving by someone's house. This person could be playing their music real loud or just making real loud noises with a car or something like that. There could be a neighbor or somebody who's going to tell you that they saw um, this person, somebody in front of your house. I feel like this is in front of a masculine house, though. Yeah, we got single. So, oh, yeah. So, there is a baby mama out here that's torn. Um, this is somebody who... Um, whew, I'm here at too hot to try. <laughs> Family, for some of you guys, whoever this is is wanting to come towards you, they really need to get their affairs straight first. Because I'm seeing like an energy attached to them that could come in and start causing you problems as well. Now, whoever this baby mama is, I'm picking up like a menace to society. This is the type of person that um, would do things very maliciously just to get revenge, okay? Or to get back at you or get back at this person. I'm actually seeing somebody acting like a fool, okay? Um, somebody is going to tell this person something or could end up telling this person where you live. But I'm hearing this is somebody who's like a train wreck. This is somebody who is very bitter and angry as well. Or for some of you, if you are dealing with somebody, there is a baby mama that's very vengeful right now because they feel like um you stole their man or something like that or Sagittarius what we got good omens but it can't kind of came out sideways here so family for some of you um I'm picking up that this could be good news for you, okay? But it's bad news for somebody else. And this could be something that's going on um, in September around the full moon. But that's what I'm hearing. Good news for you, bad news for them. Somebody feel like this isn't fair. Somebody is just, I don't know, angry, okay? This is somebody who is even stooping low enough 
that like they'll do anything to keep this person even i'm hearing mirror magic okay we got copy and mirror or this is somebody who want to mirror you they want to copy you this could be somebody who's trying to imitate you dress like you all of that okay but we got illusion spell has been broken i'm wide awake and this card came out kind of in a reverse so i whoever this is that is ready to leave a situation here or have left a situation i feel like they don't found out or they will be finding out that the person that they was dealing with was trying to do some type of black magic on them or something okay this is what's causing this person to wake up yeah i feel like this person could have been under this woman's spell for a long time this could have been somebody who wondered why they could not leave this person alone. I'm also hearing why is everything falling apart? I'm hearing karmic toxic. Toxic karmic. Ex-friend is watching or asking about you. So this could be somebody who know you or whoever this person is they're asking around about the person that you're with or the person you're about to be with they can even be talking to this person's enemies or they're trying to get revenge on you okay or somebody is trying to get revenge here and they could be talking to somebody enemies or maybe the person that you was dealing with was talking to somebody that you didn't like this is a hot mess <laughs> even the people who did you dirty didn't re realize the blessings that was going to be bestowed upon your life so there's definitely a blessing coming in here your creative gifts are becoming stronger i feel like family um there is some people you don't broke contracts with that's trying to come back into your life. You got an old person that's definitely wanting to come back in, but there is a new person that's coming towards you. I also feel like this new person has been going through a lot in the past, but whoever this is, they finally don't woke up. Okay. They realize this is not where they want to be. This is not what they want to do. This is not how they want their life to keep going. I am seeing this person go through a separation. There's a baby mama out here that's born that this person done left them. So now they run into the ops trying to figure out information or give ops inf information about this person because they are mad because this person left them alone or left them single, left them by themselves to raise a baby. Some shit like that. Okay. But in the meanwhile, I feel like a lot of you guys are really focused and working on yourself at this time. You are or you will be seeing a lot of good omens. Some of you guys could end up seeing owls, deers, or ladybugs, ravens, dragonflies, wolves, um, or butterflies. But I am seeing you creating at this time. I'm seeing you, um, you're building a new life for yourself. Spirit, what are you saying? you could be checking on the people that you love or you could be spending time with your family but some of you guys you could be visiting like um relatives or um i'm getting like grandmother grandfather for some of you guys or your mom your father but i'm seeing like you guys you could be spending more time with your family or something as well or for some of you guys, you take care of your family. There could be a family member you take care of. But I feel like you're way too busy to like deal with a lot of this stuff. But I do feel like somebody new is moving towards you, but it's just not time yet. So something positive will be happening for you between now and the next new moon. Spirit, what else? Sagittarius. We got closed throat chakra. Okay, and we got arguments. So I am seeing that somebody who can have a closed throat chakra at this time, like this person really want to talk to you or they want to reach out. This could be somebody who want to text or message you. 
I feel like they want to come in, but this person really don't know what to say when they do come in. Okay. Some of you guys, this is going to be happening in September. Yeah, we got an argument. This could be somebody who is um, reminiscing about an argument that you guys had in the past. Or they feel like that last argument you guys had was like a deal breaker regarding them coming to see you or talk to you. But some of them, they feel like if they do come towards you, it's not going to do nothing but start an argument. But there's somebody who want to argue with you, okay? Or like this person, whoever this is, I feel like is coming towards you. This could be somebody you don't really know anything about or like you don't know much about this person. For some of you, because I keep seeing like this person is not directly connected to you. They're connected to somebody who has came into your life or will be coming into your life. Okay. And they're going to try to come in and start arguments with you or something. Mm -hmm. Some of you guys, you definitely got ex-friends watching you. This this could be somebody who have a child. But yeah, we got good company. I feel like Sagittarius, you could be keeping your peace right now. Um, if there are certain things that's going on in your life, you could be kind of like keeping it to yourself and not really sharing it with the world or sharing it with a lot of people. I feel like this best because I'm seeing like some messy people out here that is not wanting to let go but they also don't want to see somebody else be happy so if you are keeping things to yourself right now i really don't blame you that's probably your best bet spirit show me what i need to see okay we got green <laughs> So some of you guys could like the color green. You could have a green card. You could be having on like a green t-shirt t um, as you're watching this. For some of you guys, you could drink green tea. Or for some of you guys, like I said, you just like the color green. But I'm picking up like whatever this is, it's giving me fresh, new. Because I'm actually seeing like morning dew on the grass. But it's giving me like a fresh energy coming in for you or whoever this is that's coming towards you this is like a fresh connection or a fresh relationship i really feel like you guys are working on your health right now or you could be trying to save money i do feel like a lot of you guys are going through a rebirth at this time as well but i'm also hearing a uh, heart Something about your heart. This definitely could be new love for some of you guys. For some of you guys, you're about to be in love again. I feel like you could have waited a, a while for this. Or for some of you guys, you've been waiting for love for a while. But I'm hearing there's an opportunity here that's coming around the corner. But there's a need for you to keep a lid on it, especially for right now. I feel like for some of you guys, you got ops around you, okay? Your thoughts are very powerful. So, yeah. Um, some of you guys, you're going to receive clear information about who these ops is, too. Or who this friend is that's watching you or asking about you. Some of you guys, this is an ex-boyfriend or an ex-girlfriend, okay? That's an op, and they asking about you. Some of you guys may have decided not to post so much, or some of you guys could have took a social media page down, or you took your page down on some type of platform. But I'm getting like you hiding your hand, okay? Or you're being quiet about something here. I also feel like you are going to pick up on whoever this op is because intuition right now is really, really high. I've been talking about that a lot. 
okay the collective just went through a major activation we got crowded places so i'm seeing you guys could end up going out having fun spending time with friends i'm seeing friends here um you could be out socializing enjoying yourself enjoying good music I also feel like uh, when you step out, you shine. You could be getting a lot of attention at this time, or you will be getting a lot of attention here. But I'm really seeing you guys just enjoy yourself. But I'm hearing main attraction. Like, you're going to be the main attraction, or you demand attention when you step in a room. Something about your voice, but I'm also hearing, like, your light or the way you carry yourself. You could be, um, I want to say spontaneous, <laughs> but um, you could just be the hype of the party or something. But I'm seeing like people enjoying you or spending time with you, or you making people laugh, or they making you laugh. Huh. Spirit, what's... you could end up meeting this person here. You make such an impact in the world. When people come across your path, they can never forget you. Unforgettable. So, some of you guys, I'm seeing like there could be somebody you end up meeting while you're out or spending time out with your friends. There's somebody you're going to be meeting here. I feel like you're going to catch this person's eye. Yeah, a comedian, actor, actress. Some of you guys, you could be a comedian. You could be going to a show and you could end up meeting this person. Or this person is a comedian. But I'm seeing like somebody you can have fun with or you enjoy spending time with. This person really make you laugh. They they have a lot of humor. I'm just seeing a lot of laughter. Okay, I feel like this is definitely going to help you lighten your mood. For some of you guys, you have been kind of going through something. Spirit, what else? We got divine partner, emperor. Taking care of business. Enriched woman. So, family, Sagittarius. For some of you guys, you got a divine emperor coming in towards you. This is somebody who is wanting to take care of business, okay? I feel like you're not like the people they done dated or you're you're just different, okay? I feel like you got a good head on your shoulders. You're really smart. You're intelligent. You believe in, you know, taking care of business or you work real hard, but just as hard as you work, you like to play real hard too. And I feel like this is somebody who want that. <coughs> Whoever this person was dealing with, they could have been dealing with somebody who's really, really serious or somebody who always stayed in drama, always stayed in trouble or always started arguments. This was somebody who was more like this person, mama, than their partner is what I'm being told. Um, some of you guys, you could be working right now. You could have a really good job or a business, but I feel like whoever this is that's coming towards you, this is somebody who's going to help you go higher. This is somebody who's about their business. Let's see. Spirit, show me what I need to see, Sagittarius. Let me hear it up. What do Sagittarius need to know? What do Sagittarius need to know? Okay, we got shy. So somebody is acting real shy. Or somebody is afraid to come in and talk to you. Or this is somebody who has been wanting to come and talk to you, but they struggle to do this. This person could be struggling to express themselves, their thoughts or needs. This could also be somebody who um, have been watching you. Or for some of you guys, you could be shy. 
you might come off as being spontaneous or very funny or you draw in a crowd but when it comes down to the opposite sex you could be a little bit shy okay spirits mysterious we also got sad somebody is shy and sad somebody is definitely holding on to a lot of grief okay we got friendship There could be a friend that's wanting to come in and talk to you, but this person is real shy. Okay, this could be somebody who's going through a lot. But I feel like this could have been somebody who betrayed you with ops being right under sad. This could have been somebody who betrayed you or turned their back on you, or they could have told somebody some information about you, or they did something to shame you, or something like that. I feel like this person is wanting to come towards you, but they don't know how. For some of you guys, this could have been your road dog, your best buddy, your pal, all of that. But I'm hearing too big for their britches. This person could feel like you're too big for your britches, or you feel like this person is too big for their britches. Something like that as well. Spirit, we got fall. Somebody that's afraid to come in and talk to you is going to be coming in towards you this fall. <laughs> betrayal. What I just say. There is a betrayal here. For some of you. For some of you guys. You already know about this betrayal. All right. Or if you did this to somebody else, they already know about this betrayal. Um, yeah, <laughs> um, whoever this is, I feel like they're needing to talk to you or they're wanting to talk to you because there was some type of deception here. I feel like this person could have double crossed you. This could have been somebody who was jealous of you as well. Or I'm also seeing like this person could have had an interest in your boyfriend or somebody you was dealing with. This could have been somebody who, and if you if you know this, you know this, okay? So don't be like, oh my God, did he do that? Or did she do that? When I say this, you're gonna already know if this part is for you or not. Whoever this friend is, could have been somebody who slept with your ex or slept with this person while you was with them. And you could have found out about this, okay? This person might feel like you don't know, but then again, they feel like it's a possibility you do know. And that's for some of you, only the ones that this resonate with. I feel like you're not even really bothered about it. Like, to be honest with you, a lot of you guys, you don't moved on from it or you don't even think of this person no more. You really don't. You, you don't think of this person anymore. I feel like you're too busy. Are you life goes on okay you're not dwelling on the past but i don't feel like you guys are going to accept this person back into your life i don't see that happening you and this person could have shared a lot of great times together but this is somebody who betrayed you okay and if they scoop that low who's to say they won't do it again who's to say this person um is still not on that shit Especially if you you don't met somebody or a new person that came into your life, okay? You never know if they're looking at that person too. This could have been somebody who told somebody that you was with some secrets about you or tried to diss you behind your back. Spirit, show me what I need to see. We got justice and influence. So, yeah, there's some justice that's coming in for this whole situation. Sagittarius, I feel like you're going to be the last person laughing, to be honest with you. There's a friendship here that is on the line. This person want to make things right. I feel like for some of you guys, you are going to have a sit down with them. But I'm also seeing you guys moving away from them. Okay. 
or for some of you guys i'm gonna be honest with you you, you really ain't gotta have a sit down with them because god is dealing with this person right now and for some of them they know why they're going through karma it's because of what they did to you and so they feel like they need to come back in and apologize so they can get out of some type of karmic cycle here i feel like for some of you sagittarius also you could be an influencer or if you cross watching you could be an influencer or something whoever this is like they look up to you or something about the community looking up to you or something about you guys making an impact um this could be somebody who's seeing you come across their fyp or somebody who see you on different platforms whoever this is they're wanting wanting to come back in and talk to you or make things fair make things right because they see your level up this is somebody who want to celebrate with you now when this person was just talking shit in the past okay and for some of you guys they didn't say this shit directly to you but they was talking about you to other people and they, they didn't think your ass was going to figure that out but you knew you knew judgment okay you have made a decision it's like the people who went with you on this journey baby they cannot go all right i feel like you not being snoppy or shit like that but it's like you don't learn your damn lesson i hope you have because this is somebody who's actually watching you guys live a very comfortable life or now this person um is seeking comfort in you or now they need you but it's because you don't get a lot of healing by yourself and this is somebody who is literally watching you rise from the ashes okay some of you guys you had a lot of fake friends and they could have been your fake friends for a very, very, very long time. Spirit, what else? Yeah, they still in their south? No, baby. Okay, they want to join you because you happy. Get the fuck up out of here. Anyway, uh, says Terry, this is what I got. I hope y'all enjoyed this reading. If you did, you already know what to do. And until we talk again, peace, family.